Stay tuned to the end of this video to find out how you can win a brand new Chelsea home shirt. 100% Chelsea, hello everyone, welcome to your match preview in association with Bet Victor. Today previewing the Chelsea Everton game at home at Stamford Bridge and um, this is, this is going to be a hard one, I reckon, it's going to be a hard one. We're uh, coming off the back of a 2-2 draw against West Brom, not the best of games for various reasons, both us not really, really being solid defensively and to a symbolic referee performance, but... Let's not blame everything on that. Um, this, as I said, will be a hard game. Now, if I go into form guide and I speak about how we've been in terms of our last few games and how Everton have been, um, it's quite pretty similar. You know, we are unbeaten in a good five games. Um, Everton are unbeaten in four. But they do sit 11th in the league while we sit 14th and it doesn't look like we're moving anywhere, um, <laughs> unfortunately. But we need to get some wins going. Everton, last game... Drew 0-0 against Man City at the Etihad, which is a great result for them. Um, you know, showing exactly how they can keep a block together, how they can keep everything solid, and that's where we're lacking. So, you know, I think our task against Everton that's, that we're going to find really, really difficult is actually trying to get past them um, in any sense, whether it's their, their front line or their back line. They're a really solid unit, and we're going to find it hard um, get, getting past them. On the plus side, as I've said, we've been unbeaten in five. However, quite a lot of them have been draws. You know, the, the, the Watford game, we struggled. Crystal Palace, we managed to win and it looked like we were picking up form. And then West Brom, again, back, back to a draw. So um, it's vital, it's vital we need to start winning. While others drop points, we don't seem to be capitalising on that. And we don't seem to be getting three points where we really should be. So hopefully against Everton, we can pick up a win and nothing less. Because if we do get anything less, it's not a good sign at all. Head to head, in our last five meetings, we've won three. But our last game against them, where Naismith terrorised us, <laughs> we lost 3-1 at Goodison Park. Hopefully we don't see a repeat of that. It's hard to say that we're not going to see a repeat of that because, as I've said, Everton are a very solid team. They can hit on the counter well and defensively we're struggling. Players to look out for as well. They've got Lukaku, who we know really, really well. And he's been doing all sorts for them. And he's probably their star man. The man to watch out for is Lukaku. And defensively, we can't keep up with, um, with holding up on, on big, big names like Lukaku or big strikers who, who threaten us. We don't seem to be doing a good job. So it'd be hard to say that Lukaku won't score. Other men to look out for in the Everton team, Leon Osman, Gareth Barry in midfield, and the man we've been trying to sign since day one, John Stones. Um, he's going to be a key player for them in holding up Diego Costa, if he does play, it seems like he does. He punched the wall in the Chelsea tunnel, just to let you guys know. Showing emotion, which is a good thing. Hopefully he brings that emotion against Everton and he can really, really show John Stones uh, a thing or two. Because um, if Diego Costa's not on his game, John Stones won't have such a hard time. So, um, you know, there are players to watch out for. Everton are a good side and hopefully we pick up a win. If I'm going to go with a match prediction, um, as I said, we have to be at the top of our game. This is Everton, the same in all due respect. Watford have been good. Bournemouth caused us trouble. West Brom caused us trouble. And these, are, these are the minor teams in the league. Everton are that mid-table team who can cause an upset. And um, I'd love to say, my heart is going with a 2-0 win. You know, I think if we have everything in place and we're solid and you know, we have fluency in our play, we can win. We're at home and we'll have the fans behind us and we can win. But if I'm going to be realistic, I'm going to take off based on form and based on how we've been performing, I see nothing less than a 1-1 one -one draw. Um, I, you know, it'd be hard to get a win against Everton if we can't capitalise against West Brom, for example, where at the same time, Everton are putting on a good performance against Man City, keeping it solid and getting a nil-nil. They're going to try and do the same thing against us. They know we're brittle, so I can see them coming to the bridge and trying to just nick a 1-0, something very narrow, and just rob one. But um, that's if we let them. So hopefully, hopefully, and I stress this, our back four need to be at the top of their game. Not, nothing less, honestly. Absolutely nothing less. Um, if we do that, then I reckon we can, we, we can leave with a 2-0 win. Hopefully. 
I want to hear what you guys have to have to say. Leave your score predictions in the comment section below. Let me know how you think it's going to go. Who would you play as well? Would you stick with the same lineup as we did with West Brom? Would you like to see someone like Loftus Cheek? Personally, I'd play Loftus Cheek. I would definitely play him. I'd bring in some youth and just let the players who want to prove themselves and want to show what they can do, let them play. We've got nothing to lose. We're 14th in the league. What else can we lose? Um, honestly, get, get, get those players that want to prove themselves, give them a chance, and I'm sure we'll see some changes. But let me know in the comment section below what you guys think. Head over to the Bet Victor YouTube channel as well. Great content on there, the weekend of show. Leave your comments there. And for your chance to win a Chelsea home shirt, head over to the prediction show on the weekend of show on the Bet Victor YouTube channel um, and comment 100% Chelsea. It'll be selected at random. Subscribe to the channel as well in that chance to win the shirt. And fingers crossed, you're the one that will have that brand new Chelsea home shirt. So head over there now. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to 100% Chelsea if you're new. Check out all the social media links in the description and I'll see you guys really soon. I am Neil Razor. Tune in to the Weekender Show on Bet Victor channel. Please subscribe, make a comment and name your fan channel you've been watching, yes? And then you could win a Premiership shirt of your choice. Yay! <laughs> <laughs>